this is her fifth season on the Freeride World Tour. That doesn't even make sense to me. She's She seems like she's been here forever, but also she's super young. Uh, she's just one of those um, ageless characters. Indeed, she's got a good hit on her shoulders and some style to bring to the face today. So I'm stoked to see what she skis, what her line is. She is making her way down the ridge and into the traditional ski woman entrance. Yeah, so this is getting pretty beat up and you can see Elizabeth just pinning it out of there. That's actually a really good tactic, just not to waste any time messing around in the rocky zone. Coming back into here. Now, is she gonna have the speed? That's how you hit that cliff. Elizabeth Gerritsen putting on a clinic and then going for the big slash turn above here, transferring back into this section all the way across. It's kind of an S-bend there for Elizabeth Gerritsen, making, uh, making full use of the face. Absolutely. So stoked to see her fly over those rocks that have eaten up so many of the fields so far. Pulling a little shifty there, bringing that Elizabeth Gerritsen style. Always, always stylish. Now coming all the way across. We haven't seen too many riders over here and not many riders, honestly, since Maxime Chablot over in this section of the face. So cool for, for Elizabeth to be opening up another section, another big stomp. And Elizabeth Gerritsen going into what I'm going to call the Swiss zone because only uh, one Swiss rider so far has gone through here, and it worked out pretty well for him. Yeah, let's see what she can find. You can see the snow is a little variable, but she finds some good slushy snow and a huge stomp there that she straight lines out of. That was sick. Oh, no messing around in the Swiss zone for Elizabeth Gerritsen, top to bottom, packed with features, super stylish, and really exciting run to watch. I love that looker's left zone at the bottom, the Swiss zone really paying off and you can see if you look at the tracks she landed it with the exact same trajectory and exact same spot as Maxim Chablot so those two maybe they were scoping together but sure did work out for Elizabeth. I think they might have been in cahoots so here is that top air that ate up so much of the women's field and she just airs sails over it. A beautiful turn there for Maud Best. Yeah Maud Best will be proud of her student her tutelage paying off there and then look at this lower air boosting all the way down, bang, and then full control as she rides out. So definitely using up the acreage on the face. Every little inch of land is being put to use as she went way across, and now we just anxiously wait for the scores. Deliberations, mate. Well, some, uh, some tense moments here as the judges decide what they want to do with that. Elizabeth pointing out her, her Verbier logo, loving the local Shred Mountain Peak Performance Rider. Had a great run there. Yeah. And as we see her pushing into second place, 